50 years ago, the era of open tennis began, setting forth professional tennis as we know it today. These are the stories that have defined the open era. Pete Sampras' journey to greatness took his first big step forward at the 1990 U.S. Open. Only 19 years old, Sampras caught fire in New York. Back-to-back -back wins over Yvonne Lindell and John McEnroe brought him to the finals. Without a speck of nerves, Sampras handily beat the man who'd emerge as his greatest rival, Andre Agassi, becoming the youngest man to ever win the U.S. Open the start of a dazzling New York run. Four more victories, including a battle for world number one versus Agassi in 95. Arriving at the 2002 US Open, Sampras was the lion in winter. Seated 17th, failing to have won even a title for more than two years. But the lion could still roar. In the finals, facing who else but Agassi. Sampras summoning up one more supreme effort, closing it out in style. Sampras had joined one of his idols, Ken Rosewall, as the only man at the time to win major singles titles in his teens, 20s, and 30s. It would prove to be his final match, and at the time of his retirement, no man had ever won more major titles in a career. From boy to man, Pete Sampras had done it all, coming full circle in the Big Apple.